Right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Burnout Dominator is all about owning the track and dominating your rivals. If you want to get ahead in this game, you'll need to take risks. That means using the streets to your advantage and the traffic like an old friend. First off, you need to know about boost. Driving dangerously earns you boost. Tailgate rivals, drift around corners, drive on the wrong side of the road, and near miss the traffic. You can also steal boost from rivals by slamming, shunting, and rubbing. But earn the most by making them crash. We call this a takedown. Max out your boost bar. Hit boost and burn it all in one. This is a burn burn. Taking risks while burning refills your boost bar. Earn enough and you will perform a burnout boost chain. Get a long chain going and really dominate the track. But beware, you can only earn while you burn if your boost is burning blue. We know there are times when a smash can't be avoided. So, while you're crashing, activate impact time. And use aftertouch to steer your car into the path of oncoming rivals. And don't forget, we've kept a little extra for when you really need it. Time it right and activate Crash Break for the ultimate explosive payback. Combine Aftertouch with Crash Breaker to take down the rivals you otherwise couldn't reach. Keep your eyes open for signature shortcuts. Take down a rival in the right place and you'll unlock a whole new way to burn around the track. Now you know the basics. Let the domination begin. There we are. Right. Time to get started. How many burnouts can you chain? Yeah, it was 10 and out domination, was it? Ah, that was burnout domination. It was like roll credits, wait a minute. Oh. 
Nice. I am, like I said, I am using Art or so for this. Now, I don't have to drift any more than I have to. So, we're just gonna go with the flow and just say, yep. Yeah. Oh. Nice. The metal. Oh, sugar. No, I'm gone. Maniac time. Get any more than you have to, points wise. Yep. Oh. 
Right, so what I need to do with this one is I need to do get the car and do the race without crashing. Put someone down, nice. New car. get on with this. Thirteen, oh no, well, yeah, fourteen. Nice. Might as well do this whilst you got chance. This will get the preview one out of the way first. Which I, I took much wider line last time. This. Whoa! Okay. Don't do that. See how we get on with this. I'm not expecting miracles, but it can happen. 
I'm a bit worried because I don't see any... Holy hell. Kind of what I meant. I'm worried because I don't see any... Nice. And 49, okay. I have managed to get 147 or 148 on there at one point, but... We gotta get eight of these. I need, I need another eight. Uh, eight? I need another two. Eight, eight. Come on. Christ. I think I could probably get one fire a car crash. Uh, can I get one fire a car crash or are they all call her? Okay. Eh. Come on. Eh. Then we go. Oh, it's pretty cool, yes. Nice. I got a goal, but I also got the, the challenge as well. I got a trophy. Oh, wow. I got five. Friggin' go. Nice. Surprised I actually got that many. To be fair. With me getting that many this early on as well, means that I'm able to do a lot better than anticipated. I remember this one being incredibly difficult to do when you've got a multiplier. Oh, like that. Yeah, see, so, what I mean, it's it's not easy. I think, to be honest, I think near misses 
They're probably the bane of my friggin' existence. We were getting just loads of misses to be honest. Many as I can get my hands on. Ah. Got 35 then. I'll get cl quite close to having the rope, the, uh, the stuff. Drift 3,000 feet. The road rages are interesting because there's dark cuts. Oh. A good one. Gotta make sure I'm at least reckless. Ah. Time's up, Carl's right anyway. Went a bit mad there. There we If I can, in this one, I can actually cross a race off. I can cross two off in one go here. 
I need to crash three times and still win. And one of them will crawl a bit to take that thing out. Ah. But I can. So that's one. And then. They got. Take the next one. It's actually quite funny because I can. Okay, that's two. Three. Nice. Didn't mean to get him, but sure. There it goes on. That's like a lot, man. I wondered what would happen then. We survive, I guess. Uh, no, I don't know if Linky told you, but I, I said I was I was gonna pass on that uh, on commentating the NSG. Not like because you've asked me, I think because you asked me, you know, you, you you just asked if I was able to do it. But basically, with the Plus time schedule. I basically said I'll. I'm gonna pass on that one. I don't. I, I'll, I'll be honest, man. I, I don't do early mornings. I just don't. Like I, I, I basically fall asleep at like two or three a.m. when it comes to doing runs and stuff like that. So I'm. I'm basically gonna take a pass on it. Yeah, basically, um, like, the thing is, I've had people say, oh, do you want to do commentary for this and for that? And I'm like, your run's at, like, 2 a.m., not a chance. Because the thing is, unless there is a way I can get back to my hotel, like, I know last time I was fortunate enough to have, uh, Joseph was able to give me a ride back to the hotel. So... It wasn't too bad, I was able to just get a ride back, but Yeah. It's I mean is it in the summer, but I don't I don't think Joseph's go into it, that's the thing. That's that's the main thing as well. Like I don't know if Joe's going. He went last time. But I don't think he's going this time. I He's not said he's not going. He might still go. He's just he's, he didn't submit anything. I don't think. Or maybe he did, and I just didn't see it. I don't know. Yeah. 
That's all. Just a case of, uh... Yeah, unfortunately I won't be... I'll, I'll be at NSG, obviously. Gotta do the Eliminator race and then another Maniac. Then we're done. Nice. Oh, right. Now, as far as I remember, And so, bugger, I couldn't remember how to do this. Thing is as well, because I don't know if you're still here, but the the run that I'm that I'd be commentating is the one I've already done with you. So a anything I've spoke about before, I probably would just be speaking about again. That's the thing. I'd rather leave it up to you if you want to fill the time or or do something with it. Plus, as well, your availability it. Fits your availability, but it doesn't fit mine. That's the thing, as well. It, it fits your availability, it doesn't fit mine, that's all. Well, surprisingly, this Vash, who's there, he's doing Fast and Furious, so... He might be a fun time, but I don't know if he's going to be around at that time.
Yeah, well, if you don't like the time slot, you could always ask them to move it. That's what I do. You know, you don't like time slot. All right, fine. Can you move me? So it's it's when you're constantly getting moved about. That's what they don't like. That's the thing. Like you can you can be moved about in events. It's just as long as you don't take the mech. With two hour racer game, I accepted my fate. Not really. You you accepted the time slot that they gave you. If you're not happy with it, just tell them you're not happy with it. Like this is the thing. This is what I don't get. Like. There are people who sit back and take the slots they get given because they're too scared to speak up and it's like, if you don't like your time slot, you'll, you know, kindly tell a staff member. Like, this is the thing as well, they're not just in friggin', you know, they're not just in... They don't just make a schedule with the intention that something's going to happen. That's the thing. You know, at the end of the day, they're... They, they have a schedule, which they obviously would like to stick to. But if you prioritise stuff like, I don't know, getting a good night's sleep, then that's also okay in my book. And something that events should take into consideration that there are people who have messed up sleep schedules and stuff because you do you get people who have like messed up sleep schedules you know it's like oh well, we don't have you know I, I, I'm, I, I'm crap for sleeping anyway I'd, I'd you know That's the main thing. Yeah, but if you if you give them if you say, can you move my room further in today, they'd rather you tell them now than literally like a day or two days before. Like, some people are just stupid and they don't ask to be, to have runs moved. When it's like, oh, it doesn't really fit. And it's like, well, friggin' tell them that then. You, you, you'd get more respect off an organizer for telling them, you know, that you don't want to be in that time slot. If, if that... If that time slot, if you, you've got to go and eat or something, or... That's another thing people don't take into consideration. You know, when they want to go and eat. Because the thing is... It, you know, people don't take that into consideration at all. They just don't. And it's just stupid. I just wish people would use the common sense as well. I mean, yeah, that's true. Nothing prevents you from showing up. Very true.
So just bear with me like two minutes. I suppose in a way, yeah, nothing prevents you from showing up and stuff, but still. get like three of them by just doing this and then just do If it is faster to just wreck your car to constantly blow it up, or it is just to do that. Such state, that nice. I mean, it came out on. It came out on the PSP, which is what this is playing on. Um, and it came out on. Old. PSP and. PS2. 2007? I think. I don't know how long this run is going to take. It takes as long as it needs to. I enabled autosave because we got a corruption last time. So... Which really sucked. I was so annoyed. Honestly, I'm just going to say I'd probably play this before saying anything about it. Like, generally speaking, I quite enjoy it. Oh, good fun. Like, actually it is. I ain't kidding. They have this thing to shortcuts in here. I don't think that's some of that's in... 
Cutting to shortcuts, are they in... I can't remember. Cutting to shortcuts in Burnout 3. I can't remember. Oh my god. In Revenge the... Oh uh, yeah. Okay. What was in... Oh, it was signature takedowns, wasn't it? Yeah. It was completely RNG whether you, whether you got them or not, I thought. Damn it. Yeah, I, 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 I forgot about revenge. To be honest... I don't... I, I really need to finish revenge, but there's nothing that's... Keep it, there's, there's nothing me, there's nothing that I want to do when it comes to playing that game. I'm not going to lie to you. Like, I just, I generally don't. So yes, this is Skrillex. The Skrillex remake, actually. From uh, Horizon as well. Uh, I, I couldn't, I couldn't get on with Revenge, to be honest. Revenge was just like, I don't know. I always thought Revenge was garbage compared to the other games in the series. It just didn't look like it played better. It felt like it played worse. I think Loha was saying, like the traffic checking mechanic just didn't feel right at all. You know the one where you deliberately, te you, you rear end traffic, don't you? I remember getting turned off by Revenge, to be honest. Yeah, I did flinch though. Like, with, with, with three, I, I could play three for hours. But Revenge, I just turned off. I got bored of it. Just did get more into me. Challenge. But yeah, it's... I don't know. Maybe I need to give... Maybe I need to give Revenge more of a chance, but... I don't know, it was like... The best game in the series didn't feel that great. Like, for example, in the CMR series, it's supposed to be CMR 04, but I thought CMR 04 was terrible. I didn't think it was good at all. Burnout, the best one apparently is is Revenge. But I always thought three or Paradise was better than Revenge by a long shot. Personally. Personally speaking. I think it's the PSP games. This is probably one of the more underrated Burnout games. To be fair. Like, that's genuinely true. Like, this one's probably...
I think this is where I had the... Yeah, I don't think I'd ever run Revenge either. But I don't know why, it just, it's like... Burnout 3, in my opinion, along with Paradise, are two of the, the best Burnout games. Come on, hurry up. Um. Oh. Come on. Gotcha. Got two laps to take him down again. Well, I'll take him down again, to be honest. Aha! Rubber banding, you gotta love it. Hey. I'm surprised that actually, like, he rubber bands so hard to it. This is quite funny. Oh, he got through, nice. Crashing is part of the problem. And then we go like, uh, okay, how are you? Yes! Got him! <laughs> That's the car, taken care of. So this is where the game crashed on me last time, so. But to be fair, at this point in the run, last time, I did have signature shortcuts and everything, and I was so mad. I quite like 3, to be honest. The thing is, I, I played 3 and was like, okay, I can work with this. Yeah, I, I, I played 3 and was just like, yeah. Catch these guys up. Where the hell's first? Oh, is it there? Okay. Yeah, I quite like three, but like, there's a reason why I just kind of left it and was just like, I'll see what I can do on my first run back. And I was quite happy to get, because Riggy uh, challenged me to do. Yeah, Riggy challenged me to do uh, Burnout 3. Yeah, it's painful to run, but I'm not really in it for records or anything like that. I got my... I got my good time, my 221, and was like, right, that's me not improving. Because the thing is, now, if I want to improve, I'm really going to have to grind. I'm like, no, I'm good. I, I don't want to have to grind this again. Well... I say grind it again, like I was, like I ever grinded the game in the first place. I think I did like a few runs. I got the 221 and was like, right, that's it, <laughs> I'm done. I get a reasonably good time and I'm like, oh, I'm, I'm set, I, I'm, I'm set. I'm not, I'm not doing anything else. I don't need to do anything else. This does not require anything more from me at all. Now, 
I should have got the car for this. Gold medal. Car. Uh, trophy reward? Yes! I did. And then it should be take down the side. Yes! I already got him twice. Skyline time or whatever the hell this thing's supposed to be. Most of the franchise is actually quite bad. I can agree with the first two burnouts. Yeah, I can I can actually agree about the first two burnouts, to be honest. Funny how it's called near miss challenge, and yet you can cheese it by just doing this. There we go. The whoa, hello. Ah, damn, missed. Wow, genius. Put one car in front of the other. I thought I might end up running into a car then, but I didn't. He's good. That's not. Whoa. Okay, nice. Alright, speed run the two. Wow, the game crashed. Whilst I was in the freaking menus. At a time. Nice. Yeah, so I I played Burnout 2. I did a run of it. I think it was a blind. Oh yeah, it was a blind run. I had the splits from the record, so I eventually, which I eventually learned as I was doing how to retire from races. Um, and then, yeah, just was like, that's me, don't I guess? So I ended up not bothering. After I, I did one run, I was like, this game's a bit difficult actually. It's a bit on the hard side. Like, that's Burnout in a nutshell, it's just hard. Running the game isn't too bad, but it depends. Okay, and then we go like that. Oh, damn, I didn't get you. Son of a bitch. Come on. Ah. Uh. Holy Christ. Oh, oh well, there you go. Thank you. Don't know if I'll make this. Okay. 30 seconds to go. Survive him. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hey, I wish. Nice. Doesn't really matter what you do in that one. Race two. He's trying to give me that car. I don't want that car. What a different car? Nine takedowns. Ooh. Find out. Let's have, see how good this little car is.
Nice. Bloody hell. I don't know how the hell I missed that one. Okay. Okay. Come on. Come on. We've got a blown up car here. Hit me. Hit me. Hit me. Ah. Da 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 da. Five. Christ. Six. Seven. I got another one behind me, nice. Ah! No. Wait, wait. Eight. Okay, now I'll start wrecking the car. Yeah, wreck me, wreck me, wreck me, wreck me, wreck me. Yes. Zacko, it's up. Oh, come on. Yeah, there we go, that'll do. Oh. Yep. There we go. I don't want to get off touch takedowns, but they come in useful if I get them. Come on. Yes! One more, one more. You come on. Oh, I'll do it. Yes. So what you have to do with these cars, whenever you see one of these cars, you basically want to make sure that you get the amount of points, the 50 grand, and then that's it. Don't want the rest. Every every couple of thousand of points, I think it is, you get time uh, time boost. Sometimes the game doesn't even care. But I need fifty k. Is enough? Now, if I get this right, I should get there. Yeah. I think it is 50k. 60k, I can't remember. There you go. You gotta try and rack up points slowly. So what I'm going to do, through here, the rest of the time, just rack up near misses. Because there is achievements and stuff related to near missing vehicles. You might as well just near miss them. Keep getting points.
There we go. Thirty K is nothing. Yeah, this is as well it won't get us a bit more on it now. Because now it's like, yeah, here's the thing. Need to reach 20k, uh, 30k, sorry. Now it is faster for me to bomb it all the way to the end before I hit another rather than waiting for time to run out it's faster for me to do all the way to the end of this Now with that mount done. Basically we're gonna see what pops first. See how soon we can get these to pop. Nice. That was pretty convenient, wasn't it? And to be fair. I think that was gonna go. That was probably gonna do the same as a shortcut. Then. God damn it! Christ. Time it time expires in one takedown. Come on. Uh. Nine. Ten. All right. Fine. Oh, it could. Nice. I don't know which one that one was, but sure. Okay. Maniac.
Okay, well, let's see how we get on with this. Then we do... Ah! I don't really know if... I'll get any... closer. I think it's 60k, I don't know if I'll make it. I don't actually, yeah, I don't actually know. Oh. Yes, you do. Super coupe, let's get it going. This is where the hard bit comes in now. Where it gets more difficult. Now it's like, oh yeah. Here's, here's a, a really terrible friggin' track to try and go fast on. It friggin' is. It's terrible. What off track this is. Ocean Drive is just abysmal. The worst bit is you have to, you have to drive it. As you get further into the game, you have to drive this. More and more. It'd be fine if you didn't have to, but you do. Yeah. Ocean Drive, my god, is it is it really horrendous? Just it just is. It just is bad. Always vehicles around this section in particular. It always used to screw me over. Every time without fail. Uh, yep. Whoops. That was clean. I'll say that much. Race. Got the race and then the burnout challenge after this. Oh, you got most of the drifting done. Lots to uh, in the in the hills here. Ah, oh. 
Oh the hell. Yeah, he can kind of after with this. Nice. Yeah, this this is the car that's meant for drifting. This is this is the this is the drifter. This is definitely the car for drifting. It just it just slides. So good at sliding. Unbelievable. Funny as well, it's like. Do a race that crashing. Didn't ever think it might have been this one. That's also why I get that early, because if you get it early on, then when the cars are at the slowest and there's only one lap, it means that you're able to do like some of the attunes that involve crashing three times and still winning. Stuff like that. Taking down a rival three times, that usually gets a bit easier. In fact, you'll get that by default later on down the line um, because some of the cars will involve having to be taken down three times instead of two do you actually get that trophy achievement thing later down the line which is quite cool Wondering how many friggin' burnouts I'm gonna get by the end of this. I didn't realise it was a three lap race. Jesus Christ. The main thing that's coming out of this one though is. God damn. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Up. Yep. Yeah. The thing is with these boost bars is you need to fill them up just as quick as you would have using them. Like, there isn't a limit as to how many you can do. Apparently there is what Ventor was telling me about the other day. When you get to like 100, I think it is. It just says burnout wow. It doesn't expect you to get to 100. Uh-huh. Got the burnout challenge. 15k. Should be easy enough. Just for kind of information. So that I've got enough points. I mainly going after the gold medals and everything and most of the cars if not all of them would make sense Jesus I'm surprised they even made that Oh, hello. Nice driving AI. Oh, I'm 
Name is Charge next. And the car it comes with. What do I do? Two times burnout. Unfortunately, I've now got the problem of I can do this, but if I do a burnout now, then I'll be in big trouble. Not that. Trouble, big enough trouble. Okay. Thank. Oh. We got Maniac 2 and the Drift Challenge. I don't know if I'll be able to make this as this this particular track it just hates me. What forgot to get? What is it 40k? It was on it. Oh bloody hell. Fifty in it, fifty K. Gotta wait this one out. There's no way I'm gonna get around the circuit in 20 seconds. So sometimes you just have to wait.
Fifth challenge literally is probably the easiest gold medal you can earn. For some reason, hugging that left side wall seems to work wonders. I don't know why. It just does. So now the game's trying to kill me. Nice. Uh, I need, I, I forgot about this one. This will be a fun one. So I've got to take that thing down three times. Wish me luck. Come on. Revenge Slam 3? Not other Revenge Slam. Ah, oh, it took second. Okay. Come on. Now, I've got to make sure he comes to me. Come on. Come on. Ah. Uh, come to me, come to me. Yep. Okay. Come on. I don't really know what I'm doing. There we go. Not, I'm not a WAP leader. I will be after this, hopefully.
The thing is, I've got to make sure that I'm, you know, doing my bit. Now, I'm probably not that much further in front, yeah. I don't think I will be. The one time that actually being in the lead or just constantly burning boost doesn't feel like you... Just doesn't feel like you... Pulling away at all. Well, I'm on what, Burnout 11? And these guys are not even doing burnouts and still keeping up with me. We got, we got the car. Gold medal. Now I'm gonna quickly grab this. By that I mean, I'm gonna do this challenge to get this car. How this thing moves. I mean, then again, it's what doesn't do 200 mile hour for a reason. Silver at 40k, okay, let's speed that up a bit. Oh, 80. Oh, bloody hell. No wonder. I'm not going to be able to get this then. Jesus. Trying to see if we can get 80... left
Well, you can actually just get. Uh -uh. You can get the takedowns via after such takedowns. So we got on with us. I don't want to have to touch the tape now, I'm not sure. No. For good luck.
I'm, do I'm trying, I'm trying, but I don't know, we'll see how far we get through this. I'm very concerned about how I'm gonna do. I don't know if it's if it was this race or it was another one. I do remember one being very difficult. I don't remember which one it was, but maybe it was this. Ah, under a fifty K. Probably be like a three hour run this to be honest. Thing is, you get more points for winning races rather than losing them. Or coming like second or third, so that's my strategy. If I just win everything and collect as many like cars and stuff as I can, that'll probably work. I don't know how many I can actually do. That's 90. Wait. All I gotta do is wait.
That's the other thing as well. The name this challenge will be... Yeah, the name this challenge is... be a lot more fun. Because now I've got... What about to get 15 uh, messages? It's, it's going to be hard to get that last one now. Maybe. Come on. Or maybe not. Yeah, it's not it. There's a god and he's watching over me. Jesus Christ, okay. I mean, I got the car, but at what cost? A one. Yes!
That might be enough. I don't know, maybe. Because you get 75 points for a win, you also get 20 points, 30 points per car. But yeah, 30 points per car. And then you get. What is it? You get quite a bit, actually, to be fair. What I need to somehow do here is I need to get, I don't know, I need to get the car somehow before I hit. Um, thing is, I can boost and I need 65k. Right, okay, that was pretty convenient. Much much do I have? Okay. We don't have to do super, you just have to do the race specials. You get enough points, then you go straight into race specials. All the all the stuff that I'm doing here, I only need to unlock the race specials and then it's getting through them as fast as possible. And I have to beat the race specials. Beat the race specials um, event. Oh, pain. Best challenge over. Now bear in mind, all I need for this is a is a bronze. Don't need any more than the bronze. So I need to somehow get a bronze on this. Which could be easy enough. It is when you're in a skinty car like this. to worry now I can just that's why yep Now what I've got to do is it's just get the lowest. I don't need any cars in this one though. 
So what I'm going to be doing is basically race. Like the last bit of the run is just yeah let's race what makes it worse is i'm using like probably one of the worst cars for it but you have to use this car anyway car I use for the finale stuff but whatever they are but the US race is nimble and quick acceleration wise I'd say but we'll find out I can't remember when the guy started the last race in when he entered very specials, I can't remember. I put like Maniac and the car, but I don't actually need the car. I mean, to be honest, there you go. That's the that's the last one. I only need whatever the bronze is. What's the bronze? Fifty k. Should be easy enough. Oh, like I said, all I need is is bronze. I don't need silver or gold or anything. Just bronze would be enough. I don't have to win events going forward now. I don't have to win anything and like, oh yeah, I've got to win this and I've got to win that. It's like, no, 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 I don't anything. You don't have to win nothing. I guess I might end up winning the car just by complete act and well, that's fine by me. I also don't want to do that because ideally I want to I mean, I do want to get bronze. Oh, help there. Oh. Thing is, I can win this and use this in the road rage if I so desire. In terms of everything else.
We've got six takedowns to do in this thing. Hi Shen. Be interested to see if I can get any friggin' And it's this thing. He says that, like, immediately gets friggin'. Oh nice, I got a sensor shortcut. At the time, I don't want it. Or is it that friggin' crash of the game or something? That's gonna stop me. Um oh. Six. Need six. I need two more. Maybe you little thing. Oh, hang on. Uh, hang on. Whoa. Ah. I don't know where you are. Where are you? Show yourself. What? Where are you? Uh, hold on. Yeah, so have I. Jen. Yeah, nice. Now let's just go. Been single digit in a while, I bet. If I get this car, I'll be happy. I don't. Oh. I don't actually need... I need the... I don't want the car, but I should get it, really. For the sake of having it, you know, for the finale. Okay, this is... Second. Okay, second. Ah. Three, yeah. Uh... Now, unfortunately, there's this interesting dilemma. Is, do I go friggin' gold, or do I not? Because if I go for gold, it's not gonna be to any harm. It won't harm me at all, getting gold. Go. Yeah. Doesn't, it doesn't hurt to go for gold in there. Pretty sure it doesn't. Oh. I've got the car. That's the good thing. That's the main thing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, 
Okay. Terminator. Terminator. Eliminator, Drift Challenge, and Race Special GP. Now, I only need to be in third to get through this. I need to be eliminated second. Worst thing is, this is probably one of the worst bits. Because you need to be ready for anything that comes your way. I never am with this track. Right, fourth place. I can get knocked out now if I want. I need to do 4,000 4, points in this. Drifting in an F1 car, sure. Okay then, let's... How hard can this be? For me, as long as I'm not getting any more points than I need to, that's fine. Well, it could do with some more. More points. Okay, there we go. There we go. I don't really need the extra points. Some main straight and that nice. Uh, to answer the question, Shin, will I be? Will I be? Will I be participating hunt of the week? Um, probably not, to be honest. That's the thing, probably not. But we'll see. To be honest, I ran Need for Speed Porsche on Leash to just set a time and just kind of be done with it. I don't think I'd probably run it again. I was pro I was considering at one stage to run Porsche Unleashed for an event, for a marathon, but the problem is it's two and a half hours and to be honest, without my music and stuff, I, it was fairly drool. It was very boring. I won't lie to you. I, it, it's fun, but then considering like you can easily get screwed over, like so badly. Like, one of the key things above all else is you can easily get screwed by just, you know, um, by, yeah, 
I don't know. You can easily get screwed by things on, on Porsche. To be honest. At least that's how that's what I found. Like factory driver, for example, is no easy task. Like it's a 15 minute category, but it's probably the hardest 15 minutes of my life. They were probably the, 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 the worst 15 minutes of my life doing that run. Because I didn't speak, I didn't do anything during that one. To do Porsche Unleashed PS1 ILs? No. I'm not an IL person. I've done ILs for games in the past, but I personally, I'd, I'd rather... Like, yeah, you, you can do ILs, you can perfect ILs, but then... For me, personally, I'd much rather be perfecting an entire game than perfecting one stage. Because that's basically like... That's basically glorifying stuff like, Oh, hey, um, I did this one... I, I, I did this race on... You know, on this game, and... You, you, you get... You know, a, you get a medal, I guess, for that. Two laps of this to do, and then last race. Oh. If you're wondering how, oh yeah, that was it. Yeah, the remember how I was saying, Bentolo. You get points for all sorts of stuff. The points do add up. So, like, you can... You know, you, you can... Get a lot better at the game and it, it just comes to you eventually. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, I've not had, like, the best run here. I've still not had the best run, but... The thing is that this run can be improved in every way, but it's mainly the main reason this game can be improved is it's through R and I'd say RNG more or less. But the um, getting not just every car, but also you want to be getting the signature shortcuts as well. If you get all the suits of shortcuts, then it's like, yeah, you'll probably easily be able to, you know, you'd probably easily be able to do stuff with it, to be honest. Okay. Yeah, this is it. Two twenty three, I think, maybe. 
think it is, it'll probably be 223-ish. Truth be told, that was a lot easier than I thought record-wise. I generally thought like the record was difficult to beat, and I I, I thought at one point during this run this is that someone would probably beat this. I mean, somebody will beat this. Granati! Thank you for the raid, man. You come in just as we're finishing this run. Hold on to your butts, folks, because it's going to be a record. How was uh, Dead Rising? Still grinding out the game, I take it, and still doing runs. Won't just be a PV, man. It's going to be a record by quite some margin. Just bear with me for like two minutes. Hold on to your butts, folks. It's coming. Gotta do this last lap. Might be a 222 actually, holy crap. Even faster. And this run hasn't gone perfect. This run has had its mistakes. Actually, that being said, I don't really recall crashing that much other than deliberately. So maybe this run is not perfect, but it's not far off. <laughs> Crash-wise, I only crashed when I needed to. Which is insane, really, when you consider. I mean, I've had a no, I've had a few crashes here and there. I can't lie. Not like this is completely crash-proof, because if it was, then holy crap, this run would be even faster. That'd be a 222. Oh, damn. There we go. That's it. That's it. For some reason, that's that's literally what we get told to do. Damn. Level 1 Infinity Mode run, but I died. Ooh, yikes. That's it for World Record Pace, yeah. That's, um... <laughs> I know I did the World's Battle until I beat first try. Yeah, that's... That was pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. And the thing is, what I want to do is... I want to get... Let me just take a screenshot of that. There we are. So what I need to do now is I need to clear the events that I didn't need. So that, 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 that. Uh... Oh, bro. There we go. Nice. So I got everything in that, and then everything there. My only concern is I did everything back to front, 